How's it going everybody? Lucian Sword here playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today as always. Hope you're all having a beautiful day wherever you guys might be. So today we're gonna just be playing some chill games of Brawlhalla and today we're gonna be focusing on mainly Qatar Legends. I'm gonna try to play every Qatar Legend in the game but I don't know if I will because there's actually quite a few. Uh, but we're gonna go ahead and start it out with Queen Nai. Uh, somebody... Queen Nai is best known for being like a six spammer she's very slow legend but very strong has a ton of defense look at that and in fact we're gonna go speed stance speed stance with queen Nye is probably the best stance because she's already really slow you want her to be a little bit faster all right going against our first match against pukoi playing as mirage now queen Nye is a slow legend so we're gonna have to take our time Try to get up close and personal when we have Katars and we have the spear. We're gonna just try to space Pookie over here as best as we can. Man, Queen Nye looks so good with the esports colors. Okay, Pookie's getting off to a pretty hot start. Spear versus spear is always pretty fun though. Oh man, this is gonna be a good fight, I can already tell. I'm I'm pretty rusty with Queen Nye. I'm lucky I didn't get hit from that neutral sig, to be honest. There we go. Got that side sig. Queen Nye's signatures last a lot longer than people expect, I feel like. Kind of like Azoth. Alright. Oh my goodness, that Qatar down sig off the side of the stage. If they hit that, it will spike them straight down. Love that. Queen Nye's Qatar down sig is like a better version of Sentinel's Qatar down sig almost. Like it, it's like the same thing, but it hits way bigger. Alright, so far we're doing pretty good with Queen Nye. Ooh, nice chase with that double recovery. But we still got a pretty good lead here. I think if I could keep this damage lead, we have a good chance to win because Queen Nye has a lot of defense, so it's, it's harder for him to uh, damage me up. He's probably got to do... Actually... Mirage doesn't have that low of defense either. Mirage has a lot of strength. Ooh, that spot dodge! <laughs> Queen Nye is too strong, you can't be spot dodging on her. Let's see if I can finish the job here. Queen Nye has kind of got a bad reputation for being like a Sig Spam legend, but she's actually not bad. And... Do we got him? Maybe? Almost got her. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. We got one more stock to finish off Mirage. Let's see how we can do with Queen Nye. Queen Nye games tend to last a little while because she's just so slow. But that's okay person like me, I have a lot of patience. GG, dude. GG. We got him. Queen Nye is not the most, like, fast, flashy, you know, super long strings type of legend, but she can get the job done. You know what I mean? GG, dude. GG. Well played. Alright, so moving along from Queen Nye, we have the next Qatar legend is Sentinel. Sentinel's a really fun legend too. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to play The Rock since I'm playing Sentinel here. And uh, I really don't like his uh, weapons though. Probably the ugliest weapons in the game. So I'm gonna switch him up. We're gonna give him the Making Bacon Pancakes Hammer, one of the best weapons in the game. And for the Katars, we're also gonna give him one of the best looking Katars. How about the Nightmare Claws? These are definitely one of the best looking. Alright, here we go, going against... I'm high right now, alright. Uh, he's playing as Sir Roland, Goldforge, King Knight. So, <laughs> this is pretty... He's pretty tricked out over there with the Goldforged helper and everything. My goodness. Alright, so this guy definitely plays a lot of ranked. Look how cool my Katars look. I don't particularly like using Katars versus uh, Sir Roland because Sir Roland has just got a ton of defense and even though Lance may look like a ranged weapon it actually is not bad up close. It has the downlight like that and it just stuns you. It's... 
Sir Roland has a ton of defense. So we gotta be very patient and just try to get those little hits every now and then. This guy seems really good. We're probably not gonna get like really big strings off. One hit at a time is all I need. And try to get those plays. Look at how cool my hammer looks. What? Almost got him right there. I love the colors on the rocks weapons. They look so good. Sentinel is a really fun legend too. We will get him. He is really good though. Oh man, perfect home run. Like if you like Queen Nye, Sentinel is kind of similar. You, you might like Sentinel as well. Or vice versa. If you like Sentinel, you might like Queen Nye. They're both kind of slow, heavy hitting. And they both have guitars. They have somewhat similar signatures, so. Alright, he really wants that home run. I got a feeling he's going to get it eventually too because it's hard to avoid forever. Oh my goodness, we finally got him. Man, that is funny. I'm actually a huge Sir Roland fan, so don't, don't mistake my uh, critiques of Sir Roland as, you know, looking unfavorably on him as a legend, because I actually really like Sir Roland. I think he's one of the best legends in the game, actually. Super fun, uh, super cool signatures, fun weapons. Oh, that should have hit him. Come on, BMG. I thought he would, uh, I thought he would come at us a little bit faster there, but, oh, no, no, no. Ooh, nice one. I thought I could maybe sneak in that down sig, but he was just waiting. Normally, I'd try not to go for the weapon spawn if it's really obvious that that's what, you know, I should do, but that time I did, and I got punished. We're still in a pretty sizable lead right here, though. I mean, we got him into red, but the way he's playing, you know, he... You never know. Ooh, he tried to dodge through that side sig. That bacon hammer get him right in the face every time. That's the best way to play, man. You just gotta damage him up to red and then finish him off with a nice signature hit like a side sig. He just kinda let me get back on stage, that's fine. Oh, we cracking skulls with that hammer. Yeah, this is looking good. He's got a long hill to climb if he wants to win this. Oh yeah, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, that perfect read, that dodge up. GG, dude, GG. That was a good game. All right, let's move it on. Man, at this rate, we're not gonna be able to play all the Qatar Legends. I'm gonna have to make it into two videos, baby. Let me know if you wanna see part two if I don't get through all the Qatar Legends, but we're just playing some Qatars, having fun anyways. I'm gonna try to get through every legend, but we'll see. I'm gonna go Goldforge, Lucian. We're gonna go Plague Doctor. Um, I guess I'll keep those weapons. All right, going against Dante the 13th. That's a pretty cool name. Let's see how we do with Lucian. Just so you guys know, my channel name, Lucian Sword, is nothing to do with this character, Lucian. They're not even spelled the same, so <laughs> just to clear up that confusion. Alright, here we go. You're Miko. Man, I haven't played Lucian in a long time. My blaster game is so rusty right now. I mean, I know how to do it, but... I'm just... <laughs> it's been a little bit. I would much prefer to have his guitars, but it's all good. Uh-oh. Oh, man. She's actually doing good on us with that bow. I gotta be careful. It's an even match so far. Oh, yeah, Yumiko. Come get it. All right. Katara's time. Let's see what we can do with these. And there it is. Nice little neutral sig from Lucian. I kind of figured he was trying to do that hammer side sig. Katars versus Bow is a good matchup for me, I feel. Oh my, never. What? Alright, we're alright, we're alright. Oh my goodness, nice hit. Oh, good. Bye. Good. No? Oh man. 
She just won't die! Oh, she almost got me there! Oh yeah, get that neutral sig! Oh my goodness! How'd that hammer and air hit me? I guess because I was standing right in the middle of it. Oh! He just stood right on top of me when I respawned. Feels bad. Now he's just going straight unarmed? Okay, never mind. I thought he was going to pick up that horn. Let's do some guitars. Light attack damage here. Just get him up into red. This is how you do it. Oh man, the shredding continues. Wow, nice interrupt. GG, not quite. Oh, that's a GG. <laughs> I don't know how I didn't get caught in his neutral sig, but I'll take it. GG, dude, GG. Well played, well played. That was pretty fast for uh, Lucian. Next guitar legend, we have Azuri. And I'm gonna go, mm, I'm gonna go Link's Azuri because I think it looks kind of kind of cool. And we're gonna go, ooh, Gala Colors always looks good. I think I'll go black. Let's just go black, default weapons and everything. Black Link's Azuri, that looks so cool. This is kind of an old skin for Azuri, but I still love it. And I, I like never see anybody use this skin either. So, Azuri versus Kor. Kor has a lot of defense, so I'm gonna have to hit him a lot with my Katars if I wanna get the KO. Kinda been like the theme of this whole video. <laughs> Katar Legends versus High Defense Legends. Oh man. Katars versus Gauntlets. In that matchup, I feel like Gauntlets wins, but... Only if they're off stage. On stage, Katars definitely. Uh oh. Oh, what a perfect gimp from Core. You can't expect a better gimp than that. That was beautiful. Even I respect that one. That neutral sig is hard to hit with Core. That's what I'm saying. The gauntlets off the stage, because you can grab and throw, it's just such a good gimping weapon. Oh, I should have done down sig. Katars can't grab, that's the only downside. But they can shred. His spacing on the edge is beautiful. I should have done a side air, but that's okay. He's a little bit predictable when he went close to the weapon. I just want to hit that neutral sig. I feel like if you're playing Azuri, you have to hit a, the neutral sig at least once with Katars. Get those Katars shredding. Damage him up. It's gonna take a long time. Look at that. He's only in light orange. Oh, oh, oh. I still can't hit that dunk. Hitting the neutral six harder than it looks, I guess. Wow, that was nice. We're kind of lucky to come back from that. That was a nice side sig way down there. Oh, I cannot get that neutral sig. Come on. Got him. I was hoping I could get at least one dunk with a Zuri before we finish this match. Don't know if it's going to happen, but... Oh, I should have had that spot dodge read. That was such a good one. Uh, oh, well. Oh, he got me with that hammer recovery. That's hard to recover from. All right, but we got him, guys. We got him right where we want him. He's in yellow. We're on last stock. All we got to do is try not to get hit suit a lot and just keep damaging him. And if he does hit us, got to be careful, though. Core has a lot of power, and we need to not panic if it gets close. Stay focused clutch up. Oh yeah. Side sig. Let's go. GG dude. GG. We got him. That was fun. Alright. I know I haven't completed like even half of the Qatar Legends, but we're going to do one more. We're going to end it on Ember and I'm going to go Esports version 2 colors, of course. And we're going to go Grove Warden Ember. Why not? I love this skin. 
All right, going against a Taros. Oh man, that's a bad, uh, bad matchup for Ember because Taros has massive strength and Ember has very low defense. Basically, I can't get hit more than like five times or I'm probably gonna be dead. And for him, I gotta hit him a lot of times, but. All right, he has honor, letting us get a weapon. Esports colors Taros. And he's using the Metadev Brin axe, which is pretty cool. And I think that's the Metadev Bodvar hammer. I could be wrong, but I think it is. Ah, uh, almost got that jump read. All right, all right. He kind of went for the crazy hammer gimp there a little bit when he shouldn't have, but let's see if we can shred with these guitars. Finish this video out strong. Oh, you want this weapon? Come and get it. Oh my goodness. He gave up. He gave up. Well, if you're being so predictable going for the weapon, that's what's going to happen. You got you to gotta not go for the weapon. Just wait for me to miss when, when you know, I think you're trying to go for that weapon. And then punish me. And he don't want any more. <laughs> Well, Ember is probably my best Qatar legend, but... Uh, GG dude, GG. Well, well played. And that's gonna be it for this episode, guys. We still have a few more Qatar legends to go, but we're already at like 20 minutes, I think, so... Let's see, who do we got left? We got... Ragnar. We got... Caspian. We got Linfei. So that's three. And we got Mako. So four more Qatar Legends to do. Let me know in the comments if you'd like me to do part two of the Qatar only Legends. And uh, I'll do that. So anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, friends.